Osmin. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Osmin. How are you? Uh, yes, uh, I, am, I, I am fine. Thank you. Very good. Very good. Did Thanks. you work today? Uh, yes, number one. You work today? Yes. Sí. What time did you finish? Uh, morning, 8 a.m. 8 a.m. 8 a.m. Yes. So, so right now you are in your house? Uh, yes. Uh, now are in my work, morning are in my house. Come. So how many hours? But you say you work 24 hours. 24, 24 uh, hours of work. Okay. All right. So in this moment, you are in your house. Uh, yes. Morning are in my house. Now are in my work. So you are in your work in this moment? Yes, in this moment, yes. You're working? Yes. Good. I work. Good, good, good. When do you have vacation, Osmin? Uh, in February. No, excuse me. In uh, March. Yeah. In, in, oh, in January. 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 Yeah. Okay. So how, how, how many days did you have a vacation? Uh, 16, uh, 15 days. 15 days. Okay. Yes. How do you say yes. descansar in English? Uh, no, no, no. Rest. Put in the chat, please. Uh, yes. Rest. Ah, okay. Rest. Okay. Did you this rest? Is, this... Did you rest? Morning. I rest. Okay. Okay. What is what is a typical day in Osmin's life when you are free? A typical yeah. day in your life. What time do you wake up? If you are on vacation, six a.m., seven a.m., eight a.m. What time do you wake up? Seven. No, no. Excuse me. Eight. A.M. Eight. Eight a.m. Yes. Eight a.m. Okay, good, good. How many people are there in your house, Osmin? Yeah, four or three. three. Three people. Three people, my wife and my daughter. Good, good. How old is your wife? How old is your wife? Uh, my wife, the name of my wife. No. Uh, the age. La edad de ella. Ah, okay. Uh, the age of my wife uh, is uh, 49. 49. Years. Okay. Yeah. Good. And your daughter? How old is your daughter? Uh, yes, my daughter. How? My daughter uh, is? Nine. It's nine is, is one child. Nine. Nine. Yes, nine. nine years old. Oh, she's a child. Yes. She's a child. A child, yes, a child. Okay. I have, I have four. I have more four. Uh, pardon. I have more three uh, son because she is uh, number one, la última. The last one. The last. The last one. one. The last okay. one. Okay. Bien. Okay. Good, very good, Osmin. Okay, good. thank you, teacher. All right, Vilma and Ricardo, welcome back. 
Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm doing okay, thanks. How are you, Rick? I'm fine, teacher. I'm ready for the class. <laughs> Excellent. Vilma, how are you? I am fine, thank you. Good, very good. All right, what's today's date? Today is... What's today's date, people? It's Wednesday. Uh-huh, Wednesday. Which February. month? February. February. What date? Uh, 11th, 2021. Okay, good. 11th. Eleven... 2021, right there. Wednesday, February 11th, 2021. How do you say pasado mañana in English? How do you say pasado mañana in English, people? Uh, this morning. Day after day, teacher. The <laughs> day after tomorrow. Tomorrow. <laughs> the day after tomorrow means pasado mañana. How do you say, how do you say anteayer? The day before yesterday. Excellent. Okay. The day before yesterday. So, if today is Wednesday, if today is Wednesday, what is the day after tomorrow? Tomorrow will be Thursday, teacher. Okay, what about the day after tomorrow? Uh, Friday. <laughs> it's Friday. Friday, good. What was yesterday? Today was Tuesday. yesterday. Yesterday. Tuesday. What was yesterday? Uh, Monday. <laughs> Yesterday. A ver, los demás. What was yesterday? If today is Wednesday, what was yesterday? Tuesday. Tuesday. Uh huh. What was the day before yesterday? It was Monday. It was Monday. Exactly. Good. All right. Any questions or comments? Any questions about yesterday? Any que any comments about yesterday? What topics did we cover yesterday? Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh, good evening. Good evening, sorry, Rose. Sorry for the late again. Don't worry, Rose. <laughs> Better late than yes. never. Okay. Yesterday we talked about how to use simple questions exactly. in information questions. Yeah. Okay, good. One of them. One of okay. them. Okay. Now, what is the function of the simple present? Express uh, an action. What action? What? A present action. Okay, uh, when we use the simple present, we're talking about actions in general. Not necessarily now, but in general. I live in Lourdes. Pero mañana, a las nueve de la mañana, no voy a estar en Urde, voy a estar en San Salvador. So it's general information, right? So uh, we use the simple present to speak about general information, para hablar de la información en general, right? What is the auxiliary we use to make questions in the simple present? Uh-huh. 
¿Cuál es el auxiliar que ocupamos para hacer preguntas en tiempo presente simple? Do and does. Do and does. Do and does. We use do and does for actions. Do you dance? Do you watch television? Do you drive? Son acciones. Si queremos hablar de condiciones, vamos a ocupar am, is, are. How do you say estoy triste in English? I am sad. I am sad. How do you say estoy nervioso in English? I am nervous. I am nervous. Exactly. So, para hacer preguntas acerca de acciones en presente simple, usted tiene que ocupar do and does. Si va a hacer preguntas relacionadas con condiciones, usted va a ocupar am, is, are. How do you say, está frío hoy? Está frío hoy. Today is cold, teacher. Ok. It is cold today. Uh -huh. Today is cold. It is cold today. Action or condition? It's a condition. It's a condition. condition. Right. So, haga de caso que usted está hablando con alguien en San Miguel... ¿Cómo le va a preguntar a esta persona si está caluroso, si está caliente? It is hot. Is it? Is it hot today? Is it hot today? Is it hot today? Is it, is it hot today? Pregunte si algo está caro. ¿Está caro? Is it, it is expensive? expensive? Is it expensive? expensive. Pregunte si está lejos. It's so far. Is it? Is it, is it far? Is it, is it is far? It far? Wow. Imagínese que le invitan a ir a un lugar y usted nunca ha ido a este lugar. Usted quiere mm. saber la distancia. Usted dice, is it far? Is it far? Mm. Is it far? Mm -hmm. Questions or comments, people? And can I say it's so far? No, it is so far. Uh, when you say, is it so far, está tan lejos, you can say it, pero ya le han dado, uh, mm. ya tiene previous information yes. about the play, about the information. Ya sé a dónde. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Exactly. All right. Mm -hmm. Any questions? Preguntas? ¿Cuántos tiempos gramaticales hay en, uh, en inglés? Twelve. Twelve. Y estamos ahorita todavía familiarizándonos con el primero. Simple present. Simple present. Hay otros tiempos que son más difíciles, pero hay otros que son más fáciles de ocupar. Presente simple es algo que ocupamos todo el tiempo. Todo el tiempo. Tiene mucha demanda, tiene mucha frecuencia. All right. Any questions or comments? No. No. Okay, no. let me see this here. Mm -hmm. Let me see this. Mm -hmm. Okay, so can you see the document? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, what is the name of the document? Just an equation with short it's answer. Okay. So, in este caso, usted va a iniciar a hacer preguntas con do it does. ¿Cuál es la respuesta cuando usted hace una pregunta con do it does? ¿Con qué va a empezar siempre? Do you speak Spanish? Do you speak Spanish? Okay. Siempre vamos a iniciar con capital letter. Correcto. Do you speak Spanish? Yes, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Do you have uh, do you have animals in your house? Yes, I do. I have a cat. Okay, <laughs> I cat. don't. Yes, I do. In Rose, I say, no, I don't. No, I don't. Si me preguntan a mí, do you have animals in, my, in your house? My answer will be negative. Yes. Yes, I do. No, I don't. 
Entonces, si usted se fija, al inicio de cada, del 1 al 4, le dan un sentence. Dr. Stevens works at a bank. ¿Qué dice ahí? Doc, Mr. Stevens works at a bank. People. Eh, ¿Usted trabaja en un banco? No. Ok, el señor no, Stevens trabaja, trabaja en un banco. En el banco. Entonces, basado en esa oración, usted va a tener que hacer una pregunta y la va a responder de forma positiva y de forma negativa. ¿Es it clear? Yes. Ok, go ahead, please. Let me know if you have questions. Pregúnteme si tiene preguntas. Si tiene dudas. Y te está sirviendo esa compu, ¿no? Ha bajado los programas. Ha bajado los programas. for teacher yes only four only four did you finish yes okay I think so. okay one more minute people one more minute All right, volunteer for number two. Mary gets up at six o'clock. Rose, do you have number two? Yes. Does Mary get up at six o'clock? Mm -hmm. Yes, she does. And no, she doesn't. Good. Do you agree with Rose, class? Yes, teacher. Así tienen que tenerlo todos, como lo dijo Rose. Does Mary get up at six o'clock? Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Okay, volunteer for number three. Mm -hmm. 
Osman, do you have number three? It rains a lot in that country. Perdón, este que no, 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 no tengo la. ¿Tiene la número tres? La número tres no la tengo la página. Permítame que lo ver. Ah, okay. perdón. Who what, has what number, three? number three? What is number three? Uh, it rains a lot in that country. Okay. It rains a lot in that country. ¿Qué dice ahí? Llueve mucho en ese país. Llueve mucho en ese país. Ahora, ¿cómo lo va a hacer en forma de pregunta? ¿Llueve mucho en ese país? Is it rain? Does it? Does it? Is, is does it rain in that country? Does it rain? ¿Cuánto? ¿Poquito? ¿Bastante? Uh, very. Ok, ¿qué dice la número 3 ahí, Osmin? Dice, it rains a lot in the country. Y dice, llueve mucho en ese país. ¿Cómo lo va a preguntar? Does yeah. it... Question, question. Do... No, 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 no lo copié realmente. Ok, ¿alguien que quiera a Vilma Sorto? que la letra de mi celular es bien finita, teacher, perdón. Ok. No oh, problem. Vilma Sorto, do you have that one? No, no la tengo, la tres. Jessica, do you have number three? Ajá. Uh -huh. Rick? Eh, ok, teacher, the number three may be, eh, does it rain a lot in the country? Yes. Does it rain a lot in that country? The answer could be yes, does it or not? Uh -uh. Uh, it doesn't, right? Not exactly. What is the answer for that question? Does it rain a lot in that country? Um, yes, it does. Okay, no, good. It does. No, it doesn't. All right. Yes, it does. Or no, it, does. it doesn't. No, it doesn't. So, right there. Llueve mucho en ese país? Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. All right. What about number four? Sam and Kelly live in Australia. Do Sam and Kelly live in Australia? Uh huh. What is the answer? You can use they in this case. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. No, they don't. No, they don't. Very good. What's the capital of Australia? It's not Sydney. Melbourne. Melbourne. It's not Melbourne either. <gasps> oh, Australia capital. Uh -huh, the capital of Australia. It's I Canberra. Canberra. What? Canberra. Yeah. My God. Not is Sydney, no, no. No, no Sydney, 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 Sydney is the most important city. Es la ah, okay. ciudad más importante, pero no es la capital. Ah, it's Canberra. Okay. Right? How do you say motor in English? Motor. Motor. Cuando se le enciende el piloto del vehículo, ¿qué es lo que dice? Check el qué? Check engine. 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 Mm. So, um... Sydney is the engine of the country. It's the engine of the country, but it's not the capital. That the is the reason because I, I think that Sydney was the right. capital. Okay, what is the capital of the United States? Washington. Washington, huh? Washington, Washington. right. Washington. But Washington yes. is not the most important city. Hay otros que... Bueno, si usted... A Isla California solito sería como la sexta potencia mundial en economía. So, hay ciudades que son muy, mucho más importantes, pero ellos tienen sus razones por qué no han sido uh, capitals. All right, any questions about this? Preguntas, preguntas. Ok, so let's open our books.
Okay, can you see my book? Can you see my page? Yes, it's true. It's Robles Agenda. Okay, Mrs. Robles Agenda. What is the meaning of Mrs.? She's, she's married. She's married. That is correct. How do you say Mrs. Robles in Spanish? Señora de Roble. Señora de Roble. Exactly. So, cuando usted mire el Mrs., eso le indica que la persona está ocupando el apellido de su esposo. Mrs. Robles Agenda. What time does the agenda start? 7.15, teacher. 7.15. What is the first activity? Meeting with the marketing department. Okay, good. What is the second activity, Vilma? What time is the second activity? Meeting. What time is the second activity? ¿A qué hora hacer la segunda actividad de ella? Um, the second activity, la segunda. Um, seven. The second one, la segunda. La primera en la las 7 y 15. And the second one? 8. Okay. 8 what? Hey. Um, How do you say 30 in English? 30. 30. 8.30. 30. And what does she do in the second activity? ¿Qué hacen la segunda actividad? Mm. Video call. Video call. With. By the supervisor. 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 From which the company. Excellent. Very good. So at 8.30 she has the second activity. It's a video call with the supervisor from West Company. Very good. Okay, Antonia, what time is the third activity? Antonia, are you there? Hola. Hola. ¿A qué hora es la tercera actividad? What time is the third activity? Uh, eight o'clock. The third activity, <laughs> la tercera actividad. A las nueve, uh, night. Nine o'clock, good. Nine o'clock. Okay, and what is the name of the activity? ¿Qué hace las nueve? Workshop? Workshop to the... Research. Research, uh, development. Development, uh-huh. To improve. Improve the manufacturing. Yes, <coughs> process. Excellent, very good. So, la tercera actividad la tiene las nueve. ¿Qué es lo que hace las nueve? Un taller para investigación y desarrollo, para el de, Departamento de Investigación y Desarrollo, para mejorar el proceso de manufacturación. Very good. Jessica Escamilla, what is activity number four? What time is the activity number four? Jessica, Jessica, Jessica. Hola, lo siento, no podía activar el micrófono. Excuse me? No podía activar el micrófono. Ah, ok, ok. What time is the fourth activity, Jessica? Workshop lunch. Workshop lunch. ¿A qué hora es el workshop lunch? How do you say doce in English? How do you say doce in English class? Twelve. Twelve. But you can say at noon. Sure. Yeah. 
yeah, you can say it. you can say 12 p.m. or if you prefer you can say noon, noon. yes yeah. all right Janet Morales can you hear me Janet yes. Janet okay what does she do after the workshop lunch One forty-five. Okay, and what is the event? What is the activity? Second part of the workshop. Excellent. And volunteer for the last one. What time is the last activity? At five fifty-five. Uh huh. So send send tomorrow's schedule to Miss Lopez. Okay. New, sec new secretary. Okay. Uh, okay. Miss, good. Miss is correct. Miss. Yeah, Miss. 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 Okay. Right. What is the meaning of Miss, people? Uh, miss, no, her, no, no matter. Okay, Miss is to win. Is someone what? that you, we don't know is married? Good. Very good. Exactly. Exactly. All right. Any questions about vocabulary? Okay. The wor workshop, what is? Taller. Okay, thank you. Yes, yeah. workshop. Anybody else? Workshop is taller talking about an office. Uh, it's an mm -hmm. event. Oh, it's yeah. an event, but sí. if I can say a uh, taller mechanic? Uh, auto shop. Okay. Auto shop. Okay. Entonces, usted dice, fíjese que vamos a estar ocupando una nueva plataforma y mañana van a venir a entrenarnos con un workshop, con okay. un taller. Yes. Okay. Any questions, people? No es lo mismo que una capacitación. No, capacitación sería training. Okay. Yes. In five, 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 un tomorrow, lo entiendo, pero cuando te dice eh, show, what is? Schedule. Schedule. Ah, okay. Schedule. In Spanish what, is? What is in Spanish class? Schedule? Agenda. General. Horario. Horario, perdón, es que es yes. horario. Yeah, similar to an agenda. Yes, it's horario. Schedule. Okay, anybody Schedule. else? Alguien más? No. Okay, so with this information, usted va a responder las primeras tres preguntas en la parte tres. So the information, the answers are in the agenda. Entonces, tiene que leer otra vez la agenda para poder responder esas tres preguntas. Is it clear? Asegúrese de entender qué es lo que estamos haciendo ahorita porque después de este ejercicio, vamos, usted va a crear su propia agenda. Así cort, brevemente, con cuatro o cinco eventos de las cosas que hace todos los días. Any questions or comments? No, no teacher. Okay, go ahead, please. What I am here for?
Let me know when you're finished, please. I finished, Joe. Okay, one more minute, people. One more minute. All right, what is the answer for the first one? What time is the video call with the West Company? The video call is at uh, 8.30 a.m. teacher. Good, the video call is at 8.30 a.m. Do you agree with that answer? Yes. Okay, very good. Number two, what time does the workshop with the research department start? Nine hours. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Very good. Number three, what time does the company close? 1.45. What time does the company close? 55. 555. 555. Good. Uh, okay. Yes, 555. 555, yes. Okay, Rose, what time does your company close? At 6 o'clock. 6 o'clock. Jessica, what time does your company close? Osmin, what time does your company close? Osmin? Uh, yes, uh, see, okay. Uh, yes, company close. Uh, one forty-five, one eight o'clock forty-five. But your company, your company, what times? What time does your company close? Ah, ya, ya, ya. Ajá. ¿A qué hora cierra su compañía, Osmin? Ah, ok. En la tres, va. O sea, eh, A, A, M. ¿A las ocho de la mañana abre o cierra? Este, bueno, en el caso mío, digamos, cierro mi, mi trabajo, pero la compañía abre, así tiene razón. Ok. ¿Pero a qué hora cierra la compañía? Eh, um, 5 p.m. 5 p.m. Very good. Antonia, what time does your company close? Six o'clock. Six o'clock. Janet, what time does your company close? At five o'clock. Good. Rick, what time does your company close? Me too, teacher. Uh, the company closes is 5 p.m. Good. And Vilma Sorto, what time does your company Five. close? 5 o'clock. 5 o'clock. Very good. Any questions or comments, people? Preguntas acerca de esta agenda? Okay. Let me ask you. Is your routine the same every day or is it different? So, agenda es la misma todos los días o cambia? It's the same for me, teacher. Okay. <laughs> All right. What about the others? Janet Morales, do you have the same routine or does it change? It's the same routine. Okay. All right. So, Fíjense bien, eh, usted va a hacer una agenda acerca de sus actividades diarias, igual al que está ahí en, en el libro. Incluyen seis diferentes uh, actividades, incluyendo um, el almuerzo. So, inicia con su primera actividad a la hora que él inicia. 
y también incluye la hora para las diferentes actividades que usted hace durante el día. Any questions or comments? Questions? No. Okay, so how do you say cuaderno in English? Notebook. 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 Ya vieron esa película, The Notebook. Not sure. No. En español le dicen el diario de una pasión. No. Because... Yes. yes. Antonia, you watch that movie? Yes. It's, it's a nice movie. <laughs> yeah, it's a beautiful movie. It's a beautiful yeah. movie. After the class, I, I watch the movie. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> Miren, cuando, cuando tengan, when, you, when you're suffering insomnia, you know, and you watch television, that's a good option. Es una buena opción. I don't suffer insomnia, but... <laughs> Teacher, okay. where, can, where can I find this uh, movie? Netflix? Uh, uh, I don't know if it's in Netflix. It's in Netflix. It's, it's it, it is in Netflix, yes. Okay. Yeah, okay, Netflix. And I think YouTube uh, has it too. Creo que también la tiene YouTube. Okay. That's the Nature uh, Notebook. The I mean, Notebook. Not, the Notebook. Not, not, okay. it's, a, it's a beautiful movie. It's a beautiful movie. <laughs> Vieron La Vida es Bella. Did you watch the movie, La Vida es Bella? Yes. yes. Nice movie too. Nice movie too. All right. So, vamos a hacer una agenda similar a la que está en el libro. Usted va a incluir seis diferentes uh, actividades y cada actividad va con su respectiva hora. So, let's go. How do you say cosas pendientes? Pending stuff. Pending. Yeah. Pending. Let, let me let me put it in the chat. Yes. Pending stuff. Right there, pending stuff. Or pending things, if you okay. want. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. How do you say estadística? Despedir. Estadística. Oh, statistics. Ahorita se lo escribo. Thank you. Good. Statistics.
hermano. Sí. Les digo, siervo, la de... Justo, se me cuida, Igualmente, hermano. cuídese, hermano. Si tiene preguntas, hágalas. Vocabulary. Eh, one, one question. Teacher. Yes, Osmin. Eh, para decir cuando llego a mi trabajo, es correcto que diga, ahí arriba en mi job. When I arrive in my job, yes. Oh, ok, thank you. Good. And teacher, how do you say estado de cuenta um, balance balance at the, on the bank yeah balance 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 es, es uh, un estado de cuenta usted llega al banco y le sale la cajera how can I help you y usted le dice I want to check my balance ah, ok thank mm -hmm. you Good, very good.
Let me know when you're ready. Okay, one more minute, people. Right. Is everybody ready? Están todos listos? Yes, yes, yes. Ok, entonces voy a ponerlos a trabajar en pareja para que usted comparta lo que ha producido. Yes. Pero antes que nada voy a pasar lista. Give me a second. Give me a second. Voy a agarrar un lapicero, permítanme. Okay, give me a second. Tenemos a Ricardo Hernández. No, teacher. Ricardo Hernández, are you here? Yes, teacher, I'm here. Very good. Let me activate my cam. Uh, okay, hello. <laughs> okay, good. Antonia Rodriguez. Thank you. Roselena Salgado. Present. Good. Uh, Janet Morales. Present. Osmin Baires. Present, teacher. Okay. Two, four, five. Let's see who else is here. Uh, Vilma Sorto. Good. And Jessica Escamilla. Present. Okay. Vamos a asegurar para que quede en el record. Alicia Hernández. César Argueta. Claudio Osorio. Uh, Stephanie Martínez. Jacqueline Martinez, Catherine Hueso, Luis Martinez, María Esther Castillo, María Gabriela Ramos, Marta Alicia Monge, 
and Sandra Carolina Monge. All right, so, ya tenemos aquí quién está presente, quién no. Los felicito por estar acá en su Life Skill Train. Entonces, ahorita los vamos a asignar. Create Rooms. And here we go. Let's do this. in my uh, notebook and eleven uh, am I rest one moment and twelve uh, thirty hours I take my lunch and five pm Write in my notebook one more. Good, Osmin. Good. Yes. What, what time do you leave your work, Osmin? What? Excuse me. What time? A qué horas? A qué horas dejas tu trabajo? Eh. Uh, I say now activity in the day. In the night is oh, other, is other, no, other. Yeah, another. Yeah, but, another. but Rosa's yeah, okay. question is, what time do you leave your work? What time do you finish work? Okay. Uh, uh, eight. Okay. A.M. Good. Eight A.M. Okay. okay. Good. Thank you. Janet, what is Janet? And the pussy, I at eight fourteen supervise employer areas. De los empleados, pero no sé si dice employee. Employees. Employees. Y la otra es at night check the report. At night? Chequear report a las nueve. Check reports. Check reports. I tend to the square 
Gender Cash. No, no sé cómo se decía cuadro caja general. How do you say ¿Cuál that, le puse yo? Pero le voy a preguntar cuando nos visiten. ¿sí? ¿O cuál, ¿Cuál es la pregunta? Do financial report. Financial report. A 12 uh, lunch. <laughs> es lo más divertido de todo. <laughs> El lunch. Uh -huh. uh, to fill the van book. No le puse la actividad de cerrar. Ok. Teacher. Yes. Si quiero escribir, preparar resultados de, mensuales de ventas, yo lo puse preparar mon, monthly, no sé cómo es. Yeah, monthly reports. Monthly sales report, report. And sales report. Yes. Okay. Monthly reports and sales reports. Ok. Uh -huh. eh, para cuadrar este caja general, se puede decir square general cash. Um, no. It's better if you say set. Set es como preparar, arreglar. So, es mejor si usted dice set. Para set cuadrar caja. Yeah, so you uh, you set your uh, you set all your transactions. Yeah, set your box. Nah, you you set all the transactions. Set. Okay. Aquí se lo voy a poner. S E T. Set. Set the transactions, the transactions of the day. Mm -hmm. Okay. Teacher, we have a question for you. <laughs> how, how do you say viaticos? Because we didn't remember. Expenses. Expenses. Yeah, expenses. Estábamos bien. Expenses. Yeah, so digamos le dicen a Jessica, Jessica, mañana va para San Miguel. Uh, we will give you expenses for transportation. Y si en dado caso le toca quedarse por allá, ya le tenemos un lugar y ahí también le vamos a dar expenses. Mm -hmm. ¿Y en qué, en qué momento sería viatic? Uh, no sé, fíjese, honestamente no sé. Pero para decir viáticos, you say expenses. Es que como buscamos en el traductor, pero nos parecía viáticos. Y qué raro decíamos sí. nosotros, ¿verdad? Ya, ya voy a averiguar, porque realmente <ríe> nunca he escuchado esa palabra, pero sí. hay, hay palabras que existen, así como existen en español, pero nosotros nunca las ocupamos. Entonces, sí, sí, claro. me, me, me interesa saber qué significa uh, viático. Bien, sí. por eso fue en extraño. Ella, ella recordaba de que usted le había dicho que eres, nos quedamos así en, la, en el aire. ¿Cuál era? Es expenses, sí. Ya, yeah, expenses. Vamos a ver qué significa Bayaric Meaning. Dice que aviático. Sí. Pero no sé a qué se... A qué no se ¿A qué se referirán? No easy, loud. I don't know. Pero qué bien, porque no, no, nunca había esta palabra, pero voy a averiguar qué significa. La definición que tengo aquí no es suficiente, pero I'll find out. Vamos a averiguar. Uh, thank you, teacher. That's going to be my homework. <laughs> okay. Maybe, maybe you, uh, you will talk about uh, tomorrow, maybe about this one. <laughs>
Okay, esperamos a Antonia, Vilma, Janet, Rose, and Osman. They are getting back. The dream team teacher. <laughs> yeah, the dream team, exactly. <laughs> All right. Uh, any questions about the activity? Necesito un voluntario que me diga su agenda. Remember, okay. making okay. mistakes is necessary. Es necesario equivocarnos para aprender. So, Osmin, please. Okay. Uh, yes, my agenda is agenda. short. Agenda. Agenda is short uh, because it's a routine. Okay. Uh, example. 8 a.m. I arrive at my job. 9 a.m. I attend to the people. 10 uh, a.m. I write in my notebook. Okay. The 11, I rest one moment. Okay. Good, very good. Well, uh, setting house, I take my lunch. And 5 p.m., writing in my not dog one more. Good, very good, very good, Osmin. Okay. All right, okay. nice, good. Someone else, another volunteer. Thank you. Yes, Janet, please. My agenda is eight o'clock, make the statistic report. report. Okay, 10 o'clock, write the financial report. 12 o'clock, take the lunch, 1 p.m., check the balance, 2.30, send the balance to my boss, and 5 p.m., did the work. Excellent, very good, nice, Janet. Another Thanks. volunteer, please. Volunteer, volunteer. Me. Okay. Okay, go, go, go. You can do Ladies it. here. Yeah, okay. yeah, no. Okay, go. <laughs> uh huh. And at seven forty-five, I start work, and I'm I print or printing. I print. Okay. <clears throat> I print. Remission note? Yes. Um, at 8.30, I organize my documents and check pending stuff. Okay. At 9.30, I have a break to take another cup of coffee. Okay. At 12, I, excuse me, at 12, it's time to launch. At 1 p.m., I start to work again. Okay. And at 6 p.m., I leave the work. Good, very good, nice. Okay. So you have one hour for lunch? Yes. Good. Sure to one. good, good. One hour mm -hmm. is good. Yes. Sometimes good. it's, it's uh, less, no. Uh huh. Yes. Yeah. It's less time. Okay. Okay. Especially when you're busy, I imagine. Yes. yes. All right. Teacher, maybe maybe the problem is when I need to buy something for it. Uh -huh. uh, sometimes uh, we don't find. <laughs> you don't what? Uh, I, uh, sometimes oh, you don't when find. I, yeah, lunch. <laughs> right, right. That's why that's why you always need to have a plan B ready. Yeah. So just in case you don't find food, you have to know where to go. Yeah. Sometimes I bring my uh, lunch box. Good. Sometimes. <laughs> good, good, good. Okay, Ricardo, what is your agenda like? Okay, teacher, uh, sorry. Uh, my agenda is uh, seven o'clock, I check my tasks. Uh, eight o'clock, I have a meeting with my boss. 
uh, because we decide what do we should do on the date. At uh, nine o'clock, I introduce documents, for example, grades, students, I'm sorry, grades, uh, student information on platform. In this case, uh, and uh, I'm sorry, at 10 o'clock, I take a little recess on 10 minutes. In this case, I decide to drink coffee or eat something. At noon, I have a lunch. If I if I find it, teacher. <laughs> okay. Good. Uh, later, I come back at uh, 1 p.m., send information to my boss. 2 p.m., uh, from 2 p.m. to 5 p.m., I take calls of somebody needs to head about the school platform. When somebody uh, lost the password, uh, I support them. And finally, I leave my work teacher. Okay, what time do you leave your work, Rick? 5 p.m. 5 p.m., all right, good. Good job, good job. Antonia. Antonia si estaba levantando la mano si quiere. Okay. My agenda, my agenda is uh, 8 a.m. Sales department training. The credit department? Training. Oh, training department. Training department. Okay. Mm, 9 a.m. Uh, prepare monthly sales re result. Okay, monthly sales results. Good. Mm, 12 o'clock lunch time. Lunch time, good. Uh, uh, one uh, one o'clock meeting for sales report. Meeting for sales reports, yeah. uh huh. Okay. Uh, for PM answer pending emails. Okay. Uh, 6 p.m. Company close time. Okay, company's closing time. Very good. Nice. Very good, Antonia. <laughs> okay. Jessica. Jessica, Jessica. Um, in the cloud, write back emails. Okay, write back emails. Night request expenses. Uh, request expenses, good. Then send reports to cl clients. Send reports to clients. Clients. Okay. Uh huh, clients. Lunch time. What, One time, is, what time is your lunch time, Jessica? Como? What time is your lunch time? What time? One, uh, 12. Okay. 1 p.m. send agenda result. Send agenda results, uh huh. 2 p.m. play service orders. Okay, place service orders. Okay, good. I solo eso thing. Okay, nice. Very good, Jessica. What time do you Teacher. finish your work, Jessica? 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Thank you. Yes, Teacher. Ricardo. What is the difference between client and customer, teacher? They're the same. Uh, They're the same. same. Yeah, clients, customers. Yes. Okay. Thank you, teacher. All right. And last but not least, Vilma Sorto. Vilma Sorto. Okay. Uh huh. Right. At Agenda. 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 At a. At a forty supervision employer eyes. At night, check the report. Check report, uh huh. Uh, then to and your set cash. Uh, what is that activity? 
And the uh, caja general. Oh, the general um uh, general check, general balance, uh-huh. Uh, eleven do financial report. Financial report, uh-huh. Uh twelve lunch. Uh-huh. And to the field the backup book. What is the last one? Can you please repeat? Fill the water book. Fill the open. Fill algo así. Pero llenar el libro banco. Llenar el qué? Libro banco. Oh, what is a libro banco? ¿Qué es un libro banco? Es donde se van colocando las actividades financieras, como por ejemplo de los cuadros de cheques. Ok, okay. so it, it, it can be something like a journal. A journal es algo que usted lleva a diario, journal. So you can say fill the journal. Ok, and what is next, uh, Vilma? I finish. Okay, good. Very good. 5. 5 p.m. Good, very good. Nice. Good. So, any questions or comments, people? The meaning of pending teacher? What is the meaning of punch? Pending. Pendiente. Pendiente. Ah, okay. Yeah, pending. So, he said, I have some pending emails. Tengo unos correos pendientes. All right. Anybody else? All right, vamos acá con, let me check this here. Mm -hmm. Go right here. Okay, can you see the document? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay. So this is what we will do. Vamos a aplicar los WH words. When, where, who, why, bla, 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 bla. So fíjese bien cómo voy a hacer la número uno. They wanted to see Fiona. ¿A quién querían ver? Fiona. Fiona. Entonces, ¿cuál es la pregunta? ¿A quién querían ver ellos? What would be the answer for number one? Uh, who? Who did? Who did they want, did to, they see? want to see? A quien querían ver. Entonces, how do you say subrayado in English? Underlined. 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 So la pregunta tiene que estar relacionada a la parte que está um, subrayada. Entonces, lo único que tiene que hacer es poner when, why, who, where, bla, 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 and so on. Questions? No? Okay, so let's do this. What time? What time did you arrive? How much? Three? Four? Six? Six? Six?
Let me know when you're ready. I'm ready to turn. Okay, one more minute, class. One more minute. All right, volunteer for number one. They wanted to see Fiona. It's who did you, who did they want to see? Who do they want to see? Very good. Rosalena, what is number two? I got up at <laughs> seven o'clock. <laughs> what, what time did you get up? What time did you get up? Very good. Number three, Antonia, she paid $10. Oh, no sé cómo es. Uh, she paid ten dollars. ¿Cómo decir cuánto pagó ella? Ajá. How much? How much? How much did she pay? How much did she pay? Good. He didn't like the movie. Osmin, do you have that one? Uh, okay. What numbers is? Uh, four. Number four. Number four. number four. He didn't like didn't. the movie. Yeah. Uh, how 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 have the I do you have four dinner? No. 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 A, a él no le gustó la película. ¿Qué preguntaría usted al respecto de eso? I I I I not that you have four. Someone else? Uh, why, another? teacher? Yes, why? Why didn't he like the movie? ¿Por qué no le gustó la, la película? Because uh, we look for a reason for the exactly. person. Exactly. You're looking for a reason. That is correct. Because that... Uh, why? My son. Why didn't he like the movie? ¿Por qué no le gustó la película? Why didn't he like the movie? Because how much so? No. Because he had much. Much so. It's a little. Uh, yeah, much sound. Much sound. Okay. Yeah, much sound. Okay, good. We had dinner. What will be that answer, Janet? What do you have for dinner? What did you have for dinner? Number six, uh, Vilva. The meeting finished late. What? Why? What time did the meeting finish? Good. What time did the meeting finish? Very good. I ate an apple pie. I ate an apple pie. What will be the answer for that one? What kind of pie did you eat? What kind of pie did you eat? What kind of pie did you eat? Did you exactly. Eat? What about number eight? I played tennis last week. Last week. When, when, when? did you play? What did you play? When tennis? did you play tennis? Very good. Number nine. They wrote to Helen. Maybe who did you? Who did they who write, did they write to? to? Yes. Write who to? did they write to? Exactly. And what is the last one? I didn't eat the chicken. Why didn't Why? you eat the chicken? Why didn't you eat the chicken? Sorry. Any questions or comments? So recuerde, los que están programados para hoy de 10 a 11, si usted de los que están programados ya hay Buscando las 11, eh, al inicio de la sesión están programadas gente de que ya no asiste. Entonces, usted no quiere esperarse hasta las 10.30, a las 10.40, a las 
solo me dice y lo, y lo admito a las 10 o las 10 y 10 o las 10 y 20. Any questions about this exercise? Oh. No. In number four. In number four, I okay. have a doubt. Okay, number four. Let's check number four. Mm -hmm. Give me a second. Aquí está. Vamos a ver. Open, open. Number four. He didn't like the movie. I write who, who, who didn't, ah, uh, no, no, no. I will back. Didn't. Pero right. si, ah, okay. si, si no existiera el he, uh -huh. lo que se está diciendo who, sería uh -huh. válido. Who didn't like who the didn't movie? Like, ¿A yes, quién no I, le gustó I, la película? I, I admit he. Right, right. That's the, that's the reason that I choose who. Okay. Right, right. Okay, okay good. Okay, Any other you, questions, you. anybody? Anybody else? Any other questions? No, ya casi nos vamos. Se va a lectura con video que Okay, so we have the agenda. We finish with the agenda. And now we go with the time. Okay, so before we start, let me write this here. What time is it in the chat? 120. 120. 120. What is another form to say that time? 20 past one, teacher. 20 past one. Very good. 20 past one. Another option? What is a synonym of past? After. After. So, Twenty minutes after one. Right. So you no, can perfectly yeah. say one twenty. Y eso es lo que la mayoría de las gente le va a decir one twenty. Sin embargo, we have other two options. You can say twenty past one or twenty after one, and you're saying exactly the same thing. Ahora fíjese bien. Después le voy a dar tiempo para que copie el todo. What time is it there? One forty. One forty. What is another form? Uh, you can say twenty minutes to two. No. Exactly. Twenty to two. Very good. And what is the other form? Maybe maybe teacher uh forty before two. Good. No, 20 before 2. 20, no, 20, 20. 20. Sorry, sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> sorry so, yes, it's, it's all right. I forget it. <laughs> Don't worry. So, fíjese bien. ¿Cuándo usted va a aplicar pass o after? ¿Y cuándo va a ocupar el to o el before? I remember teacher when I was in the school, uh, the teacher uh, told me uh, uh -huh. when the six, uh, for example, the, the six past or six after or six before, I remember something like that, this teacher. Okay, someone else, alguien más que quiera responder, cuando voy a decir pass after y cuando voy a decir two or before? Es bien sencillo. Cuando no esté tan cerca, porque no puedo decir, si me dicen la 1 y 20, no puedo decir 40 minutos after 2. No sé. Ajá, exacto, no tiene sentido. Cuando no es estemos bien. muy cerca de la hora exacta. ¿no? Ok. How many half hours are there in one hour? Sorry, teacher. How many, how many, sec minutes how many, how many Half hours ah, sorry. are ah, there in hour. one hour. Sorry, teacher. Two. How many? Rose? Two. Two. Yeah. Two. Two. ¿Cuántas media horas hay ah. en mm -hmm. una hora? Two. Hay dos. 
Entonces, fíjese bien, si la que marca los minutos está en la primera media hora, usted va a decir past o va a decir after. Solo si está marcando la primera media hora. Usted va a decir to or before ya cuando cayó en la segunda media hora. Es decir, en el minuto 31. Y como decía Rosa, usted no va a decir a... Uh, 50 para las dos o va a decir uh -huh. 55 para la una no no hablamos así aunque la gente la entendería se son, sonaría un poco raro un poco ilógico entonces vuelvo a repetir si el reloj está marcando la primera media hora usted debe decir past or after si ya está marcando la segunda media hora se tiene que decir to o tiene que decir before Any questions? ¿Cómo se dice en 30 minutos? Half hour. 30 minutes or half hour? Ajá, ahí está en el chat. 30 minutes okay. equals half hour. half hour. Okay, what is another form to say 15 minutes? Water. A quarter, yes, a quarter. A quarter. Ajá. Entonces, fíjese bien. What time is it there? Five thirty. Five thirty or five and a half. Five thirty. Or, fíjese bien, en español decimos las cinco y media. En inglés, si usted está hablando de horarios, de horas, la palabra media va al inicio. Entonces usted va a decir half past five. Half past five. Usted puede decir five and a half, pero va a estar hablando de una medida, no de la hora. Ah, okay. Digamos, usted okay. llega con su hijo a, a la shoe store en the, in the sales person. ¿Qué número calza? Exacto. Usted dice five and a half. Ahí está bien. Pero para decir hora tiene que decir half past five. Any questions? Questions, questions? No. So, copie lo que está ahí en el chat. Le voy a dar un minuto. You have one minute. Voy a levantar a tomar agua. Give me a second. All right, any questions about this explanation? ¿Qué tan seguido usted dice la hora en su día? Sometimes, teacher. Uh -huh. Mire, ¿qué hora es la clase? A las 8. Mire, ¿qué hora termina? A las 10. Mire, ¿qué hora se entra? A las 8. ¿Y qué hora termina? A las 5. So, it's high frequency. So, algo que se me olvidaba. Listen here. Ahí en el, en, el, en el libro le aparece esta hora. ¿Cómo va a decir esa hora usted? Si el cero va en medio, es decir, desde el minuto uno y el nueve, ¿cómo se dirá ese cero? 
O. Oh. Exactly. 108. 108. 108. Entonces nosotros decimos en español la 1 y 8. Esa y palabra ocho. I no existe. No para puedo decir 1 and 8. Ah, ah, no se puede. Okay. One Entonces eight. usted tiene que decir 108. Okay. Entonces el O se dice. How do you say entre? Between minute one and nine. Entre el minuto uno y el nueve, usted esa palabra que decimos en español y, usted no va a decir y, sino que va a decir o. Oh. Any questions? When time is uh, um, o'clock, uh, I can say one o oh, o. Oh. Uh, no. no, that's a good question. Cuando decimos o'clock? When is the, uh, how do you say, what exact? Exact hour. Exact hour. Exact hour only. Okay. La cinco, las five o'clock, ten mm -hmm. o'clock, twelve okay. o'clock. Si, es, si la hora está exacta, usted puede decir o'clock. Si a la hora de decir la hora ya lleva minutos, ya no se puede decir o'clock. Okay. Ten, one, oh. Ten, no. oh, one. Ten, oh, one. Ten, oh, one. Ten, okay. oh, one. Right. What is another form to say 12 p.m.? Big nine. 12 p.m. Midnight, no teacher. Midnight, midnight. Uh -huh. No. No. Uh, 12, what time is your lunch? Um, what time is uh, your lunch? At noon, at noon, sorry. <laughs> Good. At noon. Ah, ahora. Ah, okay, at noon. Okay, so what is another form to say 12 a.m.? Midnight. <laughs> exactly. Sorry. Yeah. Ah, okay. <laughs> I confused me. <laughs> yeah. Yes. It's so confused. Yeah. yeah. Okay, 12 p.m. La 12 de la noche, it's, it's, it's lunch. Yes. Bendita p.m. Right. Now, si son las 12, 12 a.m., then it's midnight. Then it's midnight. Yes. Teacher, what happens if uh, we got 1 a.m.? 1 a.m., yeah. 1 a.m. 1 a.m. Or 1 o'clock. Yes. Mm -hmm. Questions? No questions? But why 12 p.m. if we have 1 a.m., 12 a.m., 10 a.m., 11 a.m.? Okay, 12 p.m., 12, 12 p.m., 12 p.m., porque ahí empieza la tarde ya. 12 p.m. Ok, ok. En 12 a.m. because the morning. The beginning is of the rising. morning. Exactly. Uh, right. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. okay. All right. Any questions or comments, people? No. So, vuelvo a repetirle: si usted está programado para entre las 10 y las 11 de la noche. Ya en las últimas horas y, y quiere preguntarme, practicar, lo que sea, eh, puede pasarse a las 10 de la noche, a las 10 y 10, a las 10 y 20, y pues ahí voy a estar yo. Do you have any questions or comments about today? No. No. Thank you very much for your time. See you when I see you. Okay. Bye-bye. Thank Good you. Night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye-bye.